it's Steel Made Staples here, and today I wanted to do a video um, on another horse that I customized. It's a Schleich. And as you can see, I put all of my new and some old horses on this beautiful display shelf. And I got some of my Stable Made Customs um, finished. I got a coat on that seals the paint. Um, so I got those done. I'll do a video on some of those, and then I want to do a Schleich review video on some of the new Schleich that I got. So this is my new display shelf, so I'll show you. I got all my new, and then these two up here I got finished, the two Schleich customs, and then all the way down. So yeah, that's those. But anyhow, today we're going to get into this, and then I took one of, a mailing box and I made it into a stable for my new custom horse, as you might be able to see right here over on the side. So I'll bring in the stable first, and then we'll invite our newly guest into it. So right here is the stables. It's really cool. I don't know if you can see or not. I'm trying to help. So I'll zoom in on it. So right here... Can you see? There you go. It's a little box stable, and it's got a window for the horse to peek its head out. And on the front, it says, Happy Go Lucky or Lucky, and he is a Kanab Strubber Stallion. And then right here on the outside, he's got a little tack that holds his lead chain and halter. And then on the inside, it's got a fuzzy material at the bottom that I just laid in there. Um, a pile of apples, his water trough, and then his oats over in this corner. So yeah, that's my little stable that I created. Can you see? I don't know if you can see. Oh, it's down here. Okay. So yeah, it's pretty cool. And I also have some other accessories, like this little food trough. You can stick it here on the inside, like that. And then it can kind of just hang there to put carrots or treats in for the horse. Sorry if you hear a little noise. It's my aquarium in the background making the filter noise. And then I have some hay blocks here that, if I set this upright, you can put them over here on either side, really. But we're not going to add those in right now. You can put them out here to the side. And then also there's this little crate thing that I got in a like accessory kit with a little bucket. And that can sit right outside here, just like that. So we have our little scenery right here. And then I also have this little girl from the Schleich set, and she's holding a carrot, and she's got a bag. So she can stay out here and feed our little horse carrots. Oh, and one last thing. To get the horse to come, we got to give it the actual carrots, so... I will stick these in this way upright and put them into the trough like that so the horse can eat. Now we just have to get our beautiful horse Lucky to come over. Come on Lucky! Here he comes! Oh, you see the top of him? Yep, he is complete canab strubber. He is the Lipizzaner mold that I customized and he is so gorgeous. It took a couple days to do and then I got him sprayed and finished because the spray coat is like a spray paint coat that seals the paint. So yeah, his cute little face is so pretty. He's got like a little kind of like a heart shaped at the top and then it goes down into a little tiny stripe and then his ears are really cute side view he's so pretty he turned out really nice and then his hooves are like an orange kind of a cream colored and then his ears let me see if you can see his ears have like pink inside them like canab strubbers do and then he's got a little pink nose see pink nose at the bottom so yeah he is really gorgeous Stunning, stunning, stunning. Well, all horses are stunning, but... And then his eyes are really detailed, too. 
I'd use a really small brush to get in there without messing it up and making it look weird. <laughs> so yeah, so now we just have to get our fella to go in the stall, and there's also this plaid schleich blanket to put over his gorgeous coat to keep him clean, if he will ever stay clean. Hopefully he will. So yeah, now we just have to put him in his little stall. Here he goes. In you go, Lucky. See, and it's got nice, soft padding and everything in there. It's absolutely gorgeous. Really cool. And then I also painted the outside of the box here on these folds white to give it a little bit of a color instead of just a brown box. So yeah, I guess our new horse to the family loves it. See, our head can stick out of the little barn. <laughs> Alright, so thank you guys so much for watching. Um, hopefully I can come out with some more videos soon. And yeah, so thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't for more awesome horse videos. And I will see you later. Bye!